Monica is the only one supposed to do that. You can't do this. This isn't Doki Doki. You're breaking the fourth wall. I don't like when people break the fourth wall. I mean, not when Nico isn't there. That's why Nico is here, so you can break the fourth wall. Unacceptable bull. What is up kids, Johnny here and today I'm back with another video, you know, back at my stuff, that's what I do, I create videos, I'm a creator, yes. Uh, today I'm playing a game called Stanley Parable, uh, I've never played it before, but I like this thing right here, you see that screen right there, that effect, that's some sweet effect right there. I just want to inform you that I don't know when this video is coming out, um, I don't know if I'm currently in Albania while, we're, while you're seeing this. I just had to record it so you have some content for when I leave to Albania, I may never upload it, you know. I may never upload it as well, I, I, I should make my intro so long. Uh, let's start. This is the story of a man named Stanley. Stanley worked for a company in a big building where he was employee number 427. Employee number 427's job was simple. He sat at his desk in room 427 and he pushed buttons on the keyboard. Kind of like me. Orders came to him through a monitor on his desk, telling him what buttons to push, how long to push them, and in what order. This is what employee 427 did every day, of every month, of every year. And although others might have considered it soul winding, Stanley relished every moment that the orders came in, as though he had been made exactly for this job. And Stanley was happy. And then one day, something very peculiar happened. Something that would forever change Stanley. Something he would never quite forget. He had been at his desk for nearly an hour, when he realized that not one single order had arrived on the monitor for him to follow. No one had showed up to give him instructions, call a meeting, or even say hi. Never in all his years at the company had this happened, this complete isolation. Something was very clearly wrong. Shocked, frozen solid, Stanley found himself unable to move for the longest time. But as he came to his wits and regained his senses, he got up from his desk and stepped out of his office. Oh, we're supposed to play! True, this is a game. <laughs> uh, I, I used $10 on this game. Uh, <laughs> Patreon link in the description, guys. Uh, I, should, I should just... Uh, existing. Um, what are we doing? How to open doors? Wait. Is this a scary game? I have no idea. What? The door just closed on its own. Okay, no, no need to panic, Johnny. Let's just do this. Well, I'm just gonna. All of his co workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Oh, because. Ah, oh, you're telling this story. Great narrator. I mean, this is amazing. What is this? No, nothing. Let's just move. I don't know where I'm going. I don't know how to open doors even. What button is it to open the doors? Oh well, never mind then. You know, I kind of see where this is going. They're, they're like letting the doors be open. Like, they're opening the doors to want us to go through and not giving us any other option because. Oh well, f my hypothesis. But hey, that's just a theory, a game when theory. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Left. All right. Now that's right is the right door. That's right. That's what. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Yes, that's exactly what I want to do. Thank you, narrator. You're very nice. Is this a scary game? If I get the jump scare, I'm gonna quit. And that will be ten dollars. Ah, yes, truly a room worth admiring. It had really been worth the detour after all, just to spend a few moments here in this immaculate, beautifully constructed room. Stanley simply stood here, drinking it all in. I had to take down the but eager to get back to business, Just Stanley took the first open door on his left. 
Oh, that, that's creepy, but uh, okay, let's do it. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on track. Oh, Jesus! Oh, I need to stop being so scared now. <laughs> that legit scared me. I don't know what I'm expecting at this point. But Stanley didn't want to go back to the office. He wanted to wander about and get even further off track. So now in order to get back, he needed to go, um, uh, uh from here it's, um, What are you doing, man? Left. What it? Like, seriously, man, you're creeping me out. Just stop talking. Stop this. Oh, no. What the fuck? No, it's to the right, my mistake. Oh, no, man, quit freaking joking around and playing around with... No, 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 not the right. Why would I have ever said it was to the right? Can you... What was I thinking? What are you doing, man? It's clearly... Oh, dear, would you hold on for a minute, no, please? No, man, I, I paid ten bucks for this game. Now, let's see. We went down right, left... Down, you get you get left, your crap together, man. Right. I'm serious. Yep. yep. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. I've got it now. This story is absolutely, definitely this way. Yeah. You, you close that door on me, man. I swear, I'm gonna throw a throw on a horse your way or some shoot like that. Uh, is it this way? This is so creepy. Why are you doing this to me? Okay, I'm gonna. Oh my god. No! 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 This isn't right at all. You're not supposed to be here yet. Why did this you is tell all a spoiler. This? What Quick, do you mean, Stanley? Close your eyes. Okay. 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 We just we just have to get back to um. Oh. Just tell me. Just kidding. tell me. I'm gonna close my eyes. It's but... all rubbish now. The whole story completely unusable. How about rather than waste my time trying to salvage this nonsense, we'll just restart the game from the beginning. What? And this time, suppose we don't wander so far off track. Hmm? Restart okay. the game from the top. This is fourth wall breaking, what are you doing, man? Nani? Monica is the only one supposed to do that. You can't do this. This isn't Doki Doki. You're breaking the fourth wall. I don't like when people break the fourth wall. I mean, not when Nico isn't there. That's why Nico is here, so you can break the fourth wall. Unacceptable bull. <sighs> no, you. I've been. I, I, I. No, this is unacceptable. I am not doing this. I refuse. What am I gonna do then? I need content. Peace out guys, see you in the next episode of... I don't know what this game is called, but see you in the next episode.